Today we are kicking off the show with the Parkers. Blake, Jordan, a little different from the last time we saw you guys at the trailer. How do you like this? Oh, we love it. We love having a little extra room. We got uh, our kids here and a new one here, Tice and Jude, and uh, we love having the extra space. We love our neighbors and we love Anaheim. We really do. We love that Disneyland's right next door and, and everyone's just so friendly around here. <laughs> Where is the trailer? Is it still a part of the family? Yeah, we still have it. It's back in Arkansas. It's just in storage, but we're, we're keeping it. We're going to hang on to it yeah, for I don't sure. Yeah, you can get rid of that. No. Right? It's kind it's, of our legacy. Yeah, it's its own kind of being in our family yeah. at this point. So, yeah, we're hanging on to it. I love it. Now, it's been a pretty exciting year for all of you guys. Like, obviously, from having your breakout season last year to having a son. Give us an idea of just kind of what it's been like for you the last year. Um, it's been uh, a very quick and exhilarating ride. It's been fun. Uh, you know, last year carrying over into the off season, knowing that next year, you know, with, with the Angels obviously putting together a great team, we have, I think we have one of the best teams in the league. And and then to know that we're having another one on the way is just it just uh, puts everything over the top. But we couldn't be more excited to have a, a healthy baby boy here and and another season underway with with him by our side. So we're excited. Judy, happy to have a little brother. What's it been like? I've always wanted a sibling. So Jordan, what was it like seeing Blake with a baby and, and really have that moment as a father this off season? Oh my gosh, there's no, there's not really any way to describe it. I mean, all the moms out there will know how, you know, how it feels, but there's nothing really to compare it to. I remember actually when, when we had Tyson, when we were in the hospital, he came so fast and none of our families made it. My mom, his mom, nobody made it. So it was Blake and I in the delivery wow. room. Um, and Blake was sitting in the chair in the corner and he was just like the look on his face was just so amazing he was just in absolute awe and just you know his, the, the feeling of love immediately as soon as he saw Tice was the best feeling that I've ever felt so I can't imagine how it felt for him too. To have I, was all, I was sobbing in the corner. <laughs> I'm going Blake, down. Blake come over here you can come over here and he's like <laughs> I couldn't pull myself together. Yeah. But it was good. It was a good He didn't pass good. out, so. Yeah, I didn't pass out. So you stayed yeah. in the room. Oh, yeah. Room, yeah. Oh, yeah. Jordan, what impressed you most of just seeing Blake really transform into a father? Um, well, his dad, Richard, Blake's dad, is an absolutely amazing dad. So I know that, you know, growing up with him and just having that example was <laughs> the biggest thing in Blake's life. So. I just see like his gentleness and his kindness and all of that come through in a totally different light and that's probably been been the coolest thing is just seeing his 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 softer side I guess. <laughs> what did your father mean to you kind of through your whole baseball journey and helping mold you into the great father that you've become today? Well, there's so many places I could go on this because my dad he did everything the right way. He knew uh, he knew how to get involved, but not be too involved. And he knew how to support me, but not be too demanding. And he knew how to be there for me without being too too protective and too you know nurturing. He was great all around. He coached me over the years, and he really helped me you know just practicing and getting the games, and having all the equipment, and, and just everything that he's done. And then then in college when he really wasn't you know involved as much he was always there supporting me and then pro ball came along and I've never felt more support from my family you know in, in my whole life so it's been a good run it's been a good uh, it's been a good journey and to have my family and the support system that I have means the world to me. 